Hello and welcome to another video. In this one, I'm going to show you a cool trick with Python, which helps you figure out what Unicode characters are being used. Because uh, I seem to have this problem a lot. Sometimes they don't render, sometimes they do. Uh, but anyway, let's jump into it. Okay, so the module we're going to be using today is called the Unicode Data Module. And it helpfully has a name function in it. And if you pass it a character, it'll tell you what the name of that is. That's basically the whole video, uh, but I want to show you a few examples about uh, some specific characters. Um, so first I have this string here that um, was from a chat log message in my Twitch chat bot on Saturday uh, from Drunk Time Lord, which was this character, these characters here, uh, which in some fonts render as the US flag, but in this it just shows as as us so let's take this string here uh and it looks it kind of looks like a weird character i don't know what it actually is uh, and so we're going to use unicode data to take a look at that and so we're going to do for character in s print unicode data dot name c we're going to grab the character name out of there and you can see that it is actually two characters it's regional indicator symbol symbol letter u or reg, regional indicator symbol letter s uh and you know, that's how you can figure out what those are. Uh, you can also figure out the uh, Unicode code point of those as well by looking at ORD, which will give you the decimal. Oops, we gotta actually do the loop still. Um, and so you can see this is the decimal value for that. Although usually when you look at Unicode characters, you're actually looking at the hex value of it and not that. And so you can see this is 1F1FA. Uh, and so if we were to print, capital U 0001F1FA, uh, we will see that we are able to recover that regional indicator symbol letter U character. Um, I use this all the time. It's very, very, very useful. Uh, another thing <laughs> that I've used this for is uh, I have this little to-do file here. Um, this character here, for some reason, causes a core dump in curses. <laughs> and so we could see, well, what is this character? And it is a large blue circle. And since you probably want to see the core dump, um, if we take this window and resize it down. <laughs> aborted, core dumped, oops. And I've reported the bug, so hopefully it'll get fixed at some point, but I found that amusing. Anyway, but this is a, a way that you can figure out what that character is. Uh, you can also see combining characters here as well. So if you see like skin tones or other stuff like that, those are actually separate characters that cause, you know, other emojis to have, have skin tones and such. Uh, but anyway, hopefully you found this useful. If there are additional things you would like me to explain, leave a comment below or reach out to me on the various platforms. But thank you all for watching, and I will see you in the next one.